BG brother Barry, Maurice, and Robin Gibb appeared their wives and children on Cilla Black's Christmas TV show in a rare family outing for the famously private stars. The BGs, Barry Gibb in particular, may have been considered sex symbols at various points in their careers, but rare footage from 1983 shows the stars were down to earth family men. Barry Gibb, Robin Gibb, and Maurice Gibb were appearing on Cilla Black's Christmas, a one off show produced by LWT when they invited their wives and children to join them for a beautiful rendition of Silent Night. The special event is not only unusual because the BGs are joined by wives Linda, Dwina, and Yvonne, but because they weren't even recording any music together in 1983. They instead released solo albums and wrote Kenny Rogers' Eyes That See in the Dark LP. Mary Gibb and Linda Gibb, formerly Gray, have been married for 50 years after meeting on the set of Top of the Pops and marrying in 1970. When it comes to the Bee Gees, the documentary How Can You Mend a Broken Heart does a great job of diving into the story of one of the biggest disco acts in history. It provides archival footage, recording sessions, and home videos that will come as a delight to any fan. Who were the wives of the Bee Gees? But while the documentary covers the early years of the band, including their tumultuous rise to fame and a bit of the family drama that caused the brothers to briefly split in 1970, it doesn't really get into the Bee Gees' personal lives. In case you're wondering about the brothers' wives, keep scrolling to learn more about the Bee Gees' families. Barry Gibb The last remaining Bee Gee was married twice in his life. His first marriage was to Maureen Bates, who he married at 19 years old in 1966. The couple only lasted four years and divorced in July of 1970. During the taping of the BBC's Top of the Pops in London, the live performance that Sister Leslie took part in, Barry met former Miss Edinburgh, Linda Gray.